we are advocating a structure that will make the city independent, that will make the city less susceptible to being used as an instrument of interfering with the rule of law and separation of powers. It's such a powerful body. It's such an important body. So its independence must be guaranteed. That is one of the, one of the principles that informed the, the proposals that we have de 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 developed at the center. For example, one of the ideas we are you know, pushing out is that when judges are involved, the Code of Conduct Bureau, having conducted its investigation, should submit the proposals to the Code of Conduct, uh, to the NJC, when judge, serving judges are involved. And then the NJC has a maximum of 60 days to act on it. If the, NC, the NJC does not act on those proposals in 60 days, the Code of Conduct can proceed. This is a way to ensure that the judiciary is not treated as just an appendage of the, of the executive or of any other arm of government, so that the mechanisms of the law are not used to frustrate the constitutional provisions on the dependence of the judiciary. You know, so we are growing as a democracy. This is not a, 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 an attempt to criticize anyone, but we have learned from the recent experience. And we need to strengthen our system for the protection of democracy, which exists for the protection of all of us.